Same bad, but it feels just a little bit bigger now Our song on the radio, but it don't sound the same Our friends talk about you, all it does is just tear me down Cause my heart breaks a little when I hear your name It all just sounds like Too young, too dumb to realize that I should have bought your flower and held your hand. Should have gave you all my hour when I had the chance. Take you to every party, cause all you wanted to do was dance. Now my baby's dancing, but she's dancing with another man. Hi, my name is Robin from vocalcenter.nl. Uh, this was Bruno Mars, and man, that's a high, high key voice uh, that Bruno Mars produces. And some people might wonder, how do you sing this song? And how can you help me with producing notes like Bruno Mars does? Well, I can tell you a little bit about the technique, and I can tell you a little bit about how to produce the sound that Bruno Mars does. So let's go into the song. As you just heard, I sang the first verse of When I Was Your Man of Bruno Mars. And it feels high right from the beginning. But if you look at the note, it's not that high at all. It's actually an E1, which is not that high. But because Bruno Mars places everything really light and adds, adds a little bit of head voice into his sound, uh, it feels like it's high, right? You can sing, same bad but it feels, which is without the mixture of a head voice, but you can also make it a little bit more light. Same bad, but it feels. And then for you, it feels uh, that the song is much higher, but it's actually the same note. And the trick is that uh, what Bruno Mars does is he always mixes head voice with his sound. So you can say he's never full, never full on his uh, vocal cords. He's always mixing with uh, head voice, what we call the plus one in vocal essence, which I'm going to tell you later more about. Now let's get into the difficult parts of this song. All right, so I just switched my um, computer to, because my heart breaks a little when I hear your name, it all just sounds like, Ooh, you know, that part. Um, that's pretty high, uh, but the ooh part, uh, which some uh, guys are, uh, facing and find it hard to sing is actually nothing more or less than a normal head voice in our uh, technique vocal essence that's character number one and the ooh sound is actually uh, one of the best sounds you can have if you want to sing uh, in a one uh, character of vocal essence so character one too young too dumb to realize it's sort of like hold back, restrained, sang with uh, so, so, like a lit, like there's a lit on the sound. You can't be much louder than volume seven in a scale from one to ten. Too young, too dumb to realize. And I mix with head voice. Don't forget, I make the sound louder, of uh, lighter than it um, uh, than it could be. It could be uh, much louder and more. A thick vocal cord closing. Too young, too dumb to realize is also an option, but for the style and for the way Bruno Mars is singing it, that's not the best option. It's more lightly placed. Too young, too dumb to realize, which makes it lighter, right? And then you go into the high part with, that says that I should have bought you flowers. And the, that is still a character too. But the I is going to be character number three. So I go that, which is hold back. Ah! I go to a vowel ah with a little bit of distortion. I sort of like throw it out there. I just give it away. That I, and then I go back into two. That I should have bought you flowers. And then I hold back again. So it's a switch between two and three. So we have a resume. Ooh, character number one, 
Character number two. Too young, too dumb to realize. Switch between two, three, two. That I should have bought you flowers. So you switch into two and two, three. And then we go into another hard part on this song. So we have this, that I should have bought you flowers and held your, and then you get into the word hand, right? And this is actually not that high as a note, but the character of the voice that Bruno Mars is producing is restrained, holding back. And he's not going into the word hand, but he's actually singing more hand. And hold your hand. So going to the E vowel of, uh, let's say the word sit, to, uh, what is it again? Uh, should I hold a bunch of flowers and held your hand. So you get into this E, which is actually a pretty nice sound for a song like this. When I would go to the open A, it would sound like this. And hold your hand, which is a completely different character. It's also a choice, but if you look at the style and the way Bruno Mars is singing it, he's going into the I vowel, which makes it character number two. I'm gonna sing this part for you um, from the note of Too Young, Too Dumb to Realize. Here we go. to realize that I should have bought you flowers and held your hand should have gave you all my hours when he had the chance take you to every party cause all you wanted to do was dance now my baby's dancing but she's dancing with another man well, that's a pretty hard part in this song, a, a pretty hard uh, section of the song. Um, so you go to um, take you to every party, uh, but all you wanted to do was dance, right? I take almost everything into uh, the uh, character number two and to the it vowel. So, um, take you to every party. That's like, take you to every party. Take you to every party cause all you wanted to do was And here we go into the word dance again from E to E Dance! Dance! So I go from dance So changing the vowel is changing the character Dance! You can try that If you sing the E it will open up If you sing the E it will close Dance! And that's a choice. I go from character number three into character number th uh, two by changing the vowel in a single uh, word. Dance! So you can say that the whole song for 90% is sung in character two plus one. So it's mixed with head voice, placed light. And the vowels that you use in character number two are to be shown on the screen right now. All right, but then you get through the song, you sing all the lyrics of the first and the second verse and the pre-choruses and the chorus, which is actually a pretty hard job to do. And then the final blow, it's always Bruno Mars taking the final blow into the bridge. And the bridge is something different because it's gonna take us up to the high C. And I'm gonna take you there as well. I'm gonna sing it for you one time. Here we go. Although it hurts, I'll be the first to say that I was wrong. Oh, I know I'm probably much too late to try and apologize for my mistakes. But I just want you to know. Something like that, right? So this bridge is pretty hard. And as you might have heard, I'm changing vowels in the really high notes. I was wrong, I go from uh into ah. I was wrong. And if you listen to the live version of Bruno Mars, where he's in the blue, and I'm gonna show you here where that is, 
um, you can see him changing the vowel as well. I was wrong. So he's changing the vowel and that's changing the character, which makes it pretty interesting to listen to. Um, but before we are at that high note, we also have to sing Although it hurts, I'll be the first to say that And I'm thinking character number two I'm using the vowel uh and the vowel e So if you go to the word hurts Although it hurts, I sing uh, right? And I'll be the first, I'll be the first to say that And to say that is not say that, but say that. To say that, to say that. So I'm, I'm trying to sort of like stay into this character too by changing, uh, the manipulating actually the vowel a little bit into e and a. Uh. And then we go into this wrong section. So let me show you. And we go into the bridge. Now remember the vowel changement. Although it hurts, I'll be the first to say that. I was wrong Oh, I know I'm probably much too late And so on, so on, so on So maybe if you listen to it once again Try to listen to the placement of my vowels I change the words into vowels that are close to uh and e And because I'm changing the vowels It keeps me in this character to sound Which is pretty important for a song like this. All right, so this was a little bit about the song When I Was Your Man of Bruno Mars. I hope I helped you out a little bit and uh, remember the first priority in vocal essence is think about vowel changement. Think about the character that you want to sing and add the suitable uh, vowel into the word. Be able and let it in to change the word. Abonneer je nu op Vocal TV.